Five House coming up on this week's episode of Go With The Heat. A crazed biker goes on a rampage seeking revenge and has Sonny directly in his crosshairs in the episode Biking Bikers From Hell. On This Week in Vice, we'll be covering when this episode of Miami Vice aired from March 30th to April 5th, 1987, when Miami Vice was king. In news, way back on This Week in Vice number 38, at the very beginning of Season 3 of Miami Vice, the top movie was The Color of Money. Film stars the one and only Paul Newman. And I mentioned on episode 38, he would receive his first Academy Award for his role as Fast Eddie on March 30th, the night finally came. Newman is only the fourth actor to be nominated twice for the same character from two different films. It's a shame it took so long for Newman to win the award after receiving his first nomination for his performance in Cat on a Hot Tin Roof. After countless unforgettable performances, at least the world is finally made right on this night. In music, during this time period, Club Nouveau's cover of Lean On Me will give up the top spot after spending two weeks on the top of the Hot 100. Taking over the charts is the song Nothing's Gonna Stop Us Now by Starship. The duet is the theme for the comedy film Mannequin in blah blah blah. Look, I'm not a fan of Starship, and Mannequin is a terrible movie. If you want to hear more about Starship, go check out episode 68 of Go With The Heat to hear John's breakdown of this band. In movies, kicking Bruce Willis in the movie Blind Date from the top of the box off is the comedy Police Academy 4 Citizens on Patrol. Starring a lot of the cast from the original film, including Steve Gutenberg, Bubba Smith, and Michael Winslow, the film was nominated for a Razzie has been generally panned by critics and moviegoers. Unfortunately, there was still three more Police Academy movies released after Citizens on Patrol, but this was the last for Steve Gutenberg. And that's everything you need to know that was happening when Miami Vice was king. Be sure to join us on Go With The Heat at GoWithTheHeat.com. I'd love to hear from you. Email the show GoWithTheHeat at gmail.com or follow us on Twitter at GoWithTheHeat. That's all for this week. Bye, pals.